ESP in training. My name is Nikhil. I'm from ESP, and it's gonna be Metasploit typical Aurium. Right. What is Metasploit Pro? Metasploit it is a penetration testing platform that enables you to find, exploit, and validate vulnerabilities. With Metasploit, you can build out your little tools in order to do specific tests. It's like a Lego where you have different shapes, different things, different people, and when you plug all them together, you do whatever you want to be done. You, you know, it's like you start, you press the start button and the system start grabbing all names, passwords, and the network. So again, yeah, we just prove it. It is incredible tool, yeah, where you can build out your own attacks, your own programs, or ways to do whatever you want to do. Uh, framework and pro. What is actually different? And you will know the kind of right now. So, we deployed framework, it is open source, of course, yeah, yeah, I understand. But everything you must know, you will do in command line. You know, all, all command, all scripts, you will just do it. It's hard to guess what is actually inside the program, inside the software. So that's why it's used by veteran security researchers and explorer developers. However, at the same time, Metasploit provides you choice of the pro version. It is fully featured. If we compare with the Metasploit framework, so it's just easy for you and manage data, accelerate baseline of leads. And what is very good news for you? It got a user interface. Okay, but if you still want to uh, use in command line, it has enhanced command line, even more powerful than in framework with uh, more advanced um, tests. You can build out your application more faster. Okay, all database. What does it mean? It means that every test, every um, job which you have done or every evidence, every system collected from the network, it will store in own database. Alright, yes. Create reports. It got a powerful creating reports, technical support for 24 hours and 7 days a week. Advanced attack capabilities, await detection from IPS and IDS and more features which I just didn't mention yet. Okay, Metasploit Pro deployment options. Metasploit can easily work on both platforms as a Linux or Microsoft. Also you have ability to install in a local machine or remote host. Uh, it connects to your software anywhere from any location by security connection provided by Metasploit Pro. If you connect uh, if you install on a uh, web server, you will connect your web server with the port um, 3790. Actually, you can change your uh, default port um, while the installation. And even if you install on your local machine, you also can connect from the web by using uh, local host with port 3790. Also, you uh, provided web based user interface and application program interface, then installation per name user, and enterprise level support. Okay, it is our 
technical overview and of course we will mention the system requirements of the Metascruit. System requirements will start from browser requirements. It should be Firefox, Mozilla, for and above, or Microsoft Internet Explorer, then and above. In the end, Google also could be used by you, then and later version. Okay, the system requirements. The minimum, it should be 2 GHz processor or same time 2 GB of random access memory. 1 GB plus available disk space. Recommended to have 50 GB at least. And then 200 megabit per second in the NC. Okay, an operation system could be Windows XP, Windows Vista, Windows 7, 8 and above, and the same time Windows Server starting from 2003, 2008, 2012, and above. Okay. Before we begin, of course, you will download it from the website Revit7.com. Before you will start your installation, please make sure that you deactivate your antivirus software, of course, and disable your. Okay, guys, let me explain you some basic concepts and terms of Metasploit. Okay, all work which you're gonna do, you will do in a project. Workspace calling in the Metasploit framework of SMB. Okay, everything what we do, we call it tests. As, as scans, exploits. Module, it is a standalone piece of the code which extends the functionality of the Metasploit framework and the test is required to use it. It could be exploit module which executes the data system. Actually, real module doesn't execute anything. Um, an example it is a um, denial of got a denial of the text, scans, and files. Exploit it is a program which use the vulnerabilities and deliver the payload to the data system. As you can imagine, we, for example, exploit, exploit uh, got the backpack and deliver to the data system the payload and provide the, the attacker the access. Shellcode. It is a set of instructions that exploit used as a payload. Database include all data logs, evidence, and Metasploit Pro it got their own database. So if you do one penetration testing, one scanning, all everything is collected in one database. Discovery scan, of course, for scanning in a network or around. Listener. For example, if an exploit is not working very fast, and we use a listener for waiting, the listener is waiting for target system is connecting to you. Metaprinter is an advanced payload with more functionality. You can as an example, you can download the files from the data system, um, obtain the passwords, and pivot in the network. Vulnerability in the security holes, of course. Okay, guys, so let me talk about the eBay antivirus bypass firewalls and take control. It is a great advantage of the Metasploit Pro because of the waiting antivirus 
by dynamic payload. It can wait uh, 10 top 10 antivirus solution by default. Get past IPS and DPS with the station coding and manipulating the transport line. Get around firewalls with the VPN pivoting. Through local access to local networks, through compromised host, and of course take control of compromised machines. Choose from over 200 post exploitation modules to be run with the session is created. Okay, my dear friends, I will continue this talk, talk my talking of the web user interface and enhance it command line console. It is a two choices. Okay, both of them is great and does have different people who like to use user interface and command line. Some people doesn't know how to does not so well in the programming. That's why they will prefer the user interface and it will be a very nice choice because it's very useful. But if you uh, still like to use command in command line, no worries, you can use it for the penetration testing and later go to the user interface for scanning, taking or reporting of the charges or evidence. Um, Metasploit enhanced command line for the pro console, which is more powerful and more functionality than Metasploit framework command set. Okay, and very important part and this easily create reports. Actually, basically, Metasploit Pro include two default available reports as a PCI DSS and FISP. But anyway, if the standard reports it is enough for you, so you're done. But therefore, if you need it, something more or anything else, you just can add notes or text on your own reports or while the penetration you will uh, take notes to be included we will talk about the eBay detection from IDS and IPS and nowadays the enterprise required to do the penetration testing without any driving of the lens and Enterprises requirements to test their defenses are good or no to detect their advantages attacks. Without point has many different settings to await detection from the IDS and IPS as a intrusion detection system and intrusion prevention. System. Okay, now we will talk about the issue and manage user risk with simulated phishing campaigns. Nowadays, enterprises uh, spend a lot of money to train their staff and malware prevention. It's even important than to know who is leaving you vulnerable. Okay. This is exactly for naive people to check opening the, who is opening the emails, click it on the links, submit the web forms, use it and exploit the browser. Okay guys, that's it for today. It was Metasploit Pro Technical Overview. Do you want to know more about the Metasploit or have the other inquiries? Or a simply if you have questions, please do not hesitate to contact us or just visit our website www.e-spincore.com With you was Mikhail, I'm from eSpin. <laughs>